hi um here's a little encouragement for anyone who's feeling like um they don't know what to do and you're at that big point or at that edge where you need to make a life-changing decision and you're not so sure how the start is going to pan out how this decision is going to pan out and you're in this place and you're so scared of making and starting over um i think most of the time some of us are just held back into situations um you stayed too long in a relationship in a relationship that you have left uh, because you're too scared to start over you stay too long in a job that you know that was no longer serving you because you're scared to start over uh you stayed in that old place because um you were scared to start over i think uh the fear of the unknown of starting over literally holds us back because you're too scared of change sometimes and we think that uh, maybe this is the best that we deserve at this particular time that job that's not paying you well you feel like that's the best that you deserve at this particular time and uh, um you're not matching your excellence you're not matching your worth with what you're getting you're staying in that relationship that you are in because you feel like it is the best that this person could have offered while you could get better yeah and i was just watching the netflix series um about moses and 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 in the wilderness part um there is a lot of learning and unlearning um they had to learn to how to fight because in the place that they had been before they could not fight they had to learn how to fend for themselves that food was no longer access available they had to learn to eat again in a different manner because manna was provided for them they had to learn about a god that they did not know because this is someone new that was being introduced to them they had to learn a new culture and had to know how to govern themselves because they were under rules for a long time that this was no longer the place so there had to be a lot of structure that needed to be put in place because it was no longer serving them the way it used to serve them before and so they had to unlearn and learn and so in the wilderness a lot of their mindset had to be changed in the wilderness they had to commit to something new that they were very scared of they had to start in the unknown and when you're reading this story in the bible you see that they continuously uh continue to think about what is it, what was in their past instead of looking forward to what could be their future and a lot of them died there they died in their transition era but that will not be your case because we have seen an example but you're going to make it and so the fear of starting over you could all either hold yourself back or you could allow god to work a new thing in your life and so i would tell you about isaiah 43:19 i used to hear about the scripture so many times that behold i'm doing a new thing can you not perceive it and so a new thing is first perceived before it is beheld before you see it you perceive it it's like you could smell for example you could smell of pilau in the in, in the area like the, the smell goes fast like you perceive it fast before you can behold it so this is just to encourage you myself too because i really need it um there has to be a beholding there has to be a, perce- a perceiving before the new thing comes starting over is hard but staying where you are is even harder it takes more energy yeah bye